It's Nat and Essie plus Sprinkles the bear. <laughs> Ooh, there they are. I don't know, guys. Should should I really give this to them? What if they don't like it? What if they, they get mad at me even more? I think you should. It's a way to say sorry for whatever happened last time, you know? Oh, what if they think I'm so uncool? Oh, you are so cool. I wish I am as cool as you. What do you think, Anui? <sighs> Just give it. They're gonna like it. Okay, here comes nothing. Um, joy? Sadness? Hey, anxiety. Well, hey there! What's going on? Oh, <laughs> nothing, nothing! Just say hi, and I am out of here! Uh, Joy, she has something for you, and sadness. Oh! oh, yes, I do have something for both of you. Oh, really? That's so sweet! What is it? Uh, it's this one. It's an activity book with a magic marker. It's my way of saying sorry for all the troubles that I caused last time. I hope you guys like it. If you don't like it, it's totally okay. No problem at all. I'm just gonna disappear, you know? Oh, I love magic markers. Thank you. Oh, me too. This is gonna be so fun. Our besties are going to love it. Hello besties, Essie here for Nat and Essie. This is an inside to imagining activity book with a magic marker. Let's take that one out and let's check out all the activities that we can do. Here is the first page and I love that it has all of our inside out to emotions, including the new emotions. Let's go ahead and color this up. There you go! We have anger, fear, ennui, sadness, envy, disgust, embarrassment, joy, and anxiety. Woohoo! Here is our first activity. We have to guide envy to disgust by following arrows that we are going to uncover as we color these squares. Let's go ahead and start here. I see an arrow. Let's keep going. Ooh, another arrow. And it's a carrot. It's a carrot where to go. Whoa, wait a second. That was an X. I made a wrong turn. And voila, I think we made it to the finish line. Here is this gust. And let's go ahead and color MV2. There! Woohoo! Great job, everyone! Now let's go to the next page. We have four different fear pictures, and we are going to find out which one is different from the four. So here is letter A, letter B, letter C, and letter D. A looks like C and D, B doesn't look like A, C, and D, letter B is the one that is different from everyone. This fear has pink face and hands compared to the other fears that have orange faces and hands and his bow tie, sleeves, and top. Everything is different. <laughs> Moving on. One of the characters below is about to blow their top. Connect the dots in numerical order. The character that is not crossed out is the answer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Fear is crossed out. Disgust is crossed out as well as sadness. That means anger is about to blow the top. Meaning he's about to get really angry. Now let's color the rest of the page. Anxiety is here. <laughs> and there's sadness. All oh, embarrassment and sadness are here together. How about this one? We have anger anxiety and fear and we are to find our way to the finish line by spelling out the word emotions. I know how to spell emotions. It's E-M-O-T-I-O-N-S. We just have to follow those letters. That's right, Envy. Here we go. E, 
M O T I O N S. Emotions. Now let's do it again. Now let's color our emotions right here at the top. There they are. Ooh, their emotions look really intense. Ooh, we have a matching game. Let's color circle number one. There's sadness. And number two is anger. Number three is disgust. Now let's see the other side. Ooh, there's anger, there's disgust, and then there is sadness. Number one is num letter C, number two is letter A, and number three is letter B. Now, let's do this one. First thing we want to do is color the circles. Voila! Disgust, ennui, and anger are here. Now we have to complete their names by filling out the blank space here. Disgust, g, 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 ennui, n, ennui. We needed the letter N. And anger, a, 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 anger. Letter a. Woohoo! How about we do this one? There is Joy. Let's go ahead and color her. And we're going to find all of these words from all of these jumbled letters here. First up, we got anger. Ooh, I see it already. It's right here. Anger. Next word, fear. Fear is F-E-A-R. Oh, I see it. Next up, ennui. Hmm. Little tip, you gotta look diagonally. Diagonally. Hmm. I see it. E N N U I. Ennui. Next up, we got joy. It's right here on the bottom. Envy. Oh, look. We gotta do diagonal again. And V. One last emotion, sadness. It's this one right here. Woohoo! We did it, guys. We found all the words. Okay, one final thing because I can't help it. Let's do this page. We have here anxiety. And we have to follow the pattern here to find our way through the maze. So we have a starburst, a little twisty thing that looks like a leaf, or maybe it's a splatter. <laughs> and then a thunderbolt. Okay, let's just follow that pattern and we should be able to get out of the maze. From the start to the finish line. Woohoo! That was so much fun. Thanks, Anxiety. Yeah, we loved it. Thanks. I'm glad you guys liked it. Now I can worry about other things. Like Riley's next exam. Oh, we gotta study really hard for that one. Hello? Hello? Is this thing on? Oh, hi! Hi there, besties! Well, 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 welcome back to the headquarters. It's been such a long time. So much things has happened. Riley is now 13 years old and we got some new emotions, some new friends. Let me tell you everything about it. But first, let me reintroduce everyone. I am Joy and this is Disgust. Oh, can this be any more boring? Wait, what? This is boring? 
What's boring? The, the, the whole introduction thing. This is so-and-so, this is so-and-so. I, I think we need something more fun. Or else they're not gonna like us. Yeah, I'm with the new emotions in this one too. Way to spice things up a bit in telling the story. Oh, I wish I am smart enough to tell you how. Oh, uh, I don't know. Well, well, well. Maybe Sadness has an idea. Wait, where is Sadness? Sadness? Uh-oh, she has the best ideas, and she's not here! Oh no, what are we gonna do? We are doomed! Sadness! Oh no, Sadness is gone! What if she got buried in the back of the mind forever? Ah, uh, hey Fear. Ah, Sadness! Is that really you? Or are you a ghost of Sadness? Ah, uh, it's me. Oh, there you are! You got us all worried! When I say all, I meant fear and anxiety got worried. Where did you go? What do you have in there? I was just at the back of the mind, and I got this sticker book right here. I think it's gonna be a great way to introduce the new emotions, and the new friends, and the new stories. Whoa! A sticker book! That's a brilliant idea! Okay, cool. Now, can we like get started already? All this talking is boring me. Hello besties, Essie here for Nat and Essie, and today we have the ultimate sticker book for the movie Inside Out 2. Whoa, look at all these stickers, pages upon pages of them. So let's check out this page. It says here all of Riley's emotions. Joy, Joy is super excited about all the things that has to offer Riley. It's such a fun adventure. Here is a little silhouette of Joy. And now we are going to find the right sticker for it. <gasps> Whoa, I think I found it. This sticker matches this silhouette. And let's stick it on here. Ta-da! Anger. Hot-headed anger is easily irritated. He can't stop himself from exploding when the new emotions arrive. Hey, I see the explosion right here. We found anger. Here is sadness and looks like she's laying down. There she is. Aw, she looks super sad. Disgust has strong opinions about everything gross. Is it this one right here? Do they match? I think so. Let's take it out. Oh, it is the perfect match. Now let's move on to fear. He looks like he's freaking out right now. Actually, this is the least freaked out he is. He's usually more freaked out. <laughs> let's go to the new emotions. Ennui. Boring new emotion Ennui is so unimpressed. She's sarcastic and likes to roll her eyes. Let's find Ennui. I see someone who is so bored. Ennui, also called boredom, also has sarcasm. Next, ooh, anxiety. Oh, is it talking about me? I think so, anxiety. But don't worry, all good things, all good things. Look, I think I found your sticker. Ta-da! Now, how about a big shadow right here? This is embarrassment. Let's look for a big sticker. Can't miss this one. This is pretty big. Done! Now, Envy is the smallest of them all. Where is tiny little Envy? Envy is so, so, so cute. So those are the emotions old and new. Let's continue on to this page. The real world. Riley and her best friends have finished middle school and high school is just around the corner. The girls play ice hockey for the Foghorns team and now an exciting new opportunity has come up. Could this change their lives forever? This is the page where we have Bree and Grace. Bree is the goalkeeper for the Foghorns. She will do anything to help Grace and Riley. Friends are forever. Oh, look, says here Brie. Let's stick her on here. She is wearing purple everything. I think that's her favorite color. Then we got Grace. Grace is a goofball and is always ready to make Riley and Brie laugh with their signature cheer. Awooga! Oh, there. Grace is wearing green sweatshirt. 
She does look like a goofball. <laughs> All right, we also have mom and dad. Oh, I see it. Right there. There's mom and there's dad from the stands. Let's put it right in here. Now, how about some amazing news? Coach Roberts leads the varsity hockey team, the Firehawks. She invites Riley, Bree, and Grace to a hockey skills camp. Only the best players are invited. There's Coach Roberts, and here are our three hockey players. Let's move on to the story. Outburst. Riley gets angry when mom asks why she hasn't packed for camp yet. Then she gets sad and bursts into tears. There's so much going on in her head. End of an era. Bree and Grace break some bad news to Riley. They are going to a different high school next year and won't be with her. Oh, that is such a sad part of the story. And you can see it right here. She looks really sad. There we go. <laughs> I know. It's so sad to even think about it. Don't worry, sadness. The story will get better. Now here is Val. Val is the captain of Firehawks and Riley's hero. Found her. She's right here. There you go. She is perfect in every way. Now, on to being part of the Firehawks. Poor Riley wants to impress the mighty Firehawks at camp, but things don't go her way. What if she fails? Whoa, that is a very complicated emotion. Yeah, it was you. <laughs> yeah, that was me. Firehawks! Moving on to headquarters in the mind world. The console. That's the console with the original emotions. There we go. Memory spheres. Every time Riley makes a new memory, a ball holding it rolls into headquarters. The spheres are stored on shelves. Hmm, who do you guys think is holding a sphere? <coughs> that would be me. Ah, oh no. <laughs> I almost ripped it. We're good. Next is invention. Joy, did you invent something? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. Yes, I invented a tube. I put all the negative spheres in there, all the good memories I keep, and all the bad memories I toss it away. I see it. A tube for all the negative emotions. Right here. Next, sleep tight. Ooh, the emotions are sleeping. Shh. They're right here. They're sleeping so good. The belief system. This is where the strings are that form Riley's sense of self. Here are the new arrivals. Yeah, that was not a fun night. Aww, this was when the new emotions arrived at the headquarters. There's anxiety, there's ennui, embarrassment, and envy. Ta-da! Now let's find the vault. The vault is where Riley's deepest, darkest secrets are stored. Like this cartoon character right here. And somebody from one of her favorite games. Put that there. Ooh, a new Riley. This is when anxiety grabs Riley's sense of self and throws it away. Ah, that was a really scary time. There's anxiety breaking. Riley's sense of self. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. After that, Riley started training really hard. She woke up early and she practiced really, really hard. Then sadness had to crawl in the recall tube so the core emotions can get back to the headquarters. Sorry you had to do that, sadness. <laughs> it's okay. I am just glad everything turned out okay in the end. Yes, indeed. The emotions were able to escape, get back to the headquarters, and restore Riley's sense of self. The end. Hoo-wee, what can I say? That sure was a roller coaster of emotions. But it makes for a great story. Yeah, it sure was. Now I just have to worry about it happening again. Well, you know, Riley still has some growing up to do. Wait, she still has more growing up to do? That is scary! Oh man, I just feel sadder than normal today. We lost the hockey game. I, I'm just not feeling good. 
and it's raining outside, and there's clouds. Oh, it brings on my sadness extra strong. Whoa! Hey everyone, did you see sadness? Oh my goodness, we're going to have to create something for her. We've got stickers and crayons. We have Imagine Magic ink, and we can create some pictures. And then we can also, of course, draw in here. There's some games as well, but we can draw our favorite friends. Maybe we find, hmm, a picture of sadness. I've got colors here, some red, yellow tones, and then I have some cold tones like blues, greens, and browns, and purples. And I think we can draw the perfect character with these colors. I even found this perfect drawing, look right here, of sadness. Sadna doesn't want Riley to lose the hockey game because Dad will be disappointed. But look how cute she looks in this picture. Let's go ahead and pick our colors and give this drawing to Sadness. But first we have to draw. Let's go ahead and start with the dark tones of Sadness, which is her hair, her eyebrows, and just this little part around her eye. I don't really have a light blue, but I have this like kind of charcoaly purple that might work as light blue. I also have this color for her face. So let's go ahead and have those two colors. Aww, it's total cuteness. It looks just like sadness. But we do have a background and should we add some color or should we make it blue tones just like sadness? I'm definitely gonna add some blue and then maybe we just add a little bit of different colors, but let's go ahead and add some more blue tones because sadness's room is all blue. Oh, wow, I hope Sadness loves her first drawing. We've got Fear right next to her. Oh my goodness, she's so cute, even though she's always so sad. Let's see what else we can craft for her. I've got this Inside Out Play Pack. It's got stickers, crayons, and maybe some coloring pages. Ooh. We've got some stickers. It has all of our new friends. Oh, and the best buddies there, anxiety and fear. We can flip it and we've got some more friends. Oh, and there's little sadness in the middle. We also have four colors of crayons and our pack. Let's see what all is included to draw. We've got some games. How many words can you make from letters and all these feelings. Hmm. Here's a sadness, look. I guess it's another drawing. We've got our first game. Find the path to lead and we to anger. Okay, if he's going to anger, we're going to use the color red. And I happen to have a red crayon right here. Hmm. We're gonna start with the first one, A. Oh my gosh. A led us right away to anger. First game complete. Ooh, more drawings. We have fear and anger. Oh, look. Take turns. This is a game you play with other people. Connect a line in one spiral to another. Whoever makes the line that completes the square puts his on her initial. Hmm. Trace the gray lines to finish disgust. That's a fun one. More drawings, we've got disgust. And we've got joy. Ooh, we can draw joy based on that square. We put the same lines down below. There's joy and anxiety. Oh, look, missing piece. Which one do you think fits right here? Square one, two, or three? 
Well, here's a trick you learn at school. I already have that one right here. So we're crossing out number three. I already have two right up here. So we're crossing out number two, which would only leave us number one. Make a connection using the path. Transfer the letters into the circles. Okay, let's see what word we get. Since it's discussed, we'll use the color green. Here we go, first letter. Whoa, it's like going everywhere. Oh no, I went the wrong way somewhere. Hold on, let's try again. Around, loop, it's going back up. Hmm, let's try a different letter. How about T? Okay, T goes at the end. D. Right here. Oh, here it goes. We have the word disgust. Let's keep looking. There's more pictures to draw. There's anxiety and envy. And then all of our friends together. But check this out. I really want to play with the stickers. You can sticker up anything you'd like. My kids use these colors to draw. I think I'm going to put characters on each one of them. So we've got our big embarrassment. Oh my goodness. We've got fear and anxiety. We can put them both on this side. And we can even put joy on the other one. Joy goes here. Oh my goodness, look how tiny Envy is. Super duper tiny. And, oh my goodness, Anger definitely needs to go on the pack with the red crayon. And, ugh, Disgust definitely goes with the green crayons. No oh, sadness. Oh no, is Disgust not happy about it? And let's put fear over on this side, right next to anger. And and we, or however you say his name, so bored. He can go right here. Okay, so we drew some pictures, and we put stickers all over the crayons. Let's see if we made sadness feel a little bit less sad. Wow, that really helped. I am kind of feeling a little bit better. Thanks everyone, that was so nice.